Yeah, it's obviously a huge honour. Obviously, I was lucky enough to play a few games myself, and I know what it's like to, to be presented to Guernsey. So, if uh, the club to ring me and give me that, that opportunity, I was absolutely thrilled. Especially when they told me it was going to be Jackson, obviously, a you know, local Central's boy. And, you know, there's obviously a connection there as well. So, hopefully, he goes well. He's got, you know, it looks like he's got a great footy brain, and, you know, he's been in great form in the SNFL. So, he's obviously earned his opportunity to play AFL, and I hope he goes well. Yeah, he fitted really well. Obviously, he was drafted to the GWS and decided to uh, come back to South Australia. So, Looking from afar, boys, I reckon you've really bought into Nixie's game plan. Um, you look like you're playing team first footy, everyone's sort of playing their role, mate. That'll be my advice to you, just play your role and play team first footy, and I'm sure you'll have a long, great career, so whatever. Well Oh, still great mates with a lot of the guys I play with the Crows. Obviously, I was lucky enough to play in some premierships at Centrals, but in the five years I spent at, at, at the Crows, uh, uh, some of my great memories, and still you know, I've got some great mates here, and we speak yeah, regularly. Yeah, I'm going pretty well. Obviously struggling a little bit with fatigue and concentration, but sort of back to um, you know full strength and all, all my movements. The young playing group, but even the, the past players and, and just the club in general were, were unbelievable. Their support and uh, it's very much appreciated. So it's just a matter of you know just ticking off the boxes and hopefully it sort of all comes back with the fatigue and the concentration stuff. Douglas there wrapping up McDonald. Still remember when they played at Bell Reeve, you know, a few years ago now, and that my two boys Jack and Harry got to run out with them. So. Um, Obviously this year it's in Lonnie and um, you know, it's only two hours from home and it's you know, a great little trip up and you know, lucky enough to bring Harry and we're excited to watch the game. Now I'm coaching, I've definitely hung up the boots mate, I'll be um, 39 at the end of the year so um, you know, I'm enjoying the coaching side of it and um, yeah, so I'm um, looking forward to you know, getting my teeth into that.